What's up everybody? Today I'll be unboxing two things. Uh, I was looking for a light, a studio lamp, a studio light. So I checked out, well, the bigger YouTubers like Peter McKinnon, a um, uh, uh, Potato Jet, and they were all talking about this Aperture uh, 120D or 120D2. But it's a little bit out of my budget, like a grand for a lamp. Uh, I'm just starting, so I'll have to earn my tracks and later maybe buy an Aperture. Um, so I was looking for an alternative and I found it. So here is the unboxing of the Godox SL60W LED studio lamp and the Aperture Light Dome Mini. I only have a small studio, so let's unbox. So the uh, Godox lamp, actually I unboxed it when it came in because I couldn't wait but I did want to make this video so without the unboxing part it's, it's you know it's not that exciting uh, the unboxing literally here's the lamp here's the unit the Godox SL60W 60 for 60 watts the big flat one inch LED on the front mount for your tripod or your lamp support ball boom whatever and it came with this so you can just put that on if you want there is actually you see here there's a little hole you can like pop out if you'd like and that is where the umbrella would go through to go in here right through the like through the hood it's a bowens mount bowens i think s mount is what they call it bear with me correct me if i'm wrong because i'm just i'm learning as we go and it also comes with this nice nifty little uh, rca5 controller uh, and it works up to about 20 meters. No line of sight, necessary, nothing. And you can control the, uh, let me show you in the other camera. You can control the light strength up from 10% to 100% on and off switch. And the change channels if you have more than one lamp in Godox. Ain't that nice? So that's the Godox lamp. And then here, is the aperture I, I did go for an aperture uh, uh, softbox octabox I think it's an octabox um, because it's just a nice design good build quality and um, good lighting so let's see what's in here oh, it comes with this nice bag let's see that Oh, it's actually like a, a full up pouch. Really? See? Cool. Let's take everything out. This is the mount. So. Oh, no, it's tight. This should go something like this. Come, sir. Do that a little later because first we want to uh, we want to build this uh build this softbox thingy what's in here this is the first reflector that goes inside the dome and it's actually two-sided with velcro and it's two-sided, you can do it like silver for the normal uh, reflection or color for a bit of warmth in your lighting, I assume. I can already see it from that light reflecting on the camera, makes it yellow, soft. But this is what goes inside. Then this must be the, the 
accuser. I uh, know already. I think I have to go and buy another one of these because it's. I'm not sure how long this is gonna last. But we'll see. We'll see. Let's put this over here for a little bit. Install. It's not saying or showing how to actually assemble this thing, but let me give it my best try. Here are the rods. The rods and the umbrella. Oh, this is, this is already assembled. Oh, that's good. That's cool. That's not. That's how do you... Okay, so now we have to just put that in. Red, 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 yep. Yeah. Okay. Let's see how this goes. in first and then the red one opposite of that one thank god you only have to do this once i hope all right so the two opposites of the red ones and now the other two opposite red ones and then the rest of the rods to look like something, isn't it? Cool, huh? Okay, now the rest of the rods. Nice and tight. Good, looks good, looks good. And there you have it, that's the dome. Okay. So now, what we can do, um, how should... We do this. Let's take the lamp. Click. Nice. Well, there you have it. The Godox SL60W with the uh, Aperture Light Dome Mini. Let's see what this puppy does. But first, let's um, put this. Um, diffuser in the first one and I'm just going to put it on the silver side just to start with see how it looks okay like so can you see that hmm? looks nice eh? nice very nice right and now the second skin the second diffuser layer now I'm not sure how to how it goes this way or this way. I don't think it really matters. I just uh, let's just put it on. And compared compared to uh, some other brands I've been uh, like looking at, they have like the Velcro on the outside, you know, to to attach the the, the diffuser cloth for the. the plastic thingy this the white stuff and I'm not a big fan of velcro because it's all it's always gonna wear out you know but this although it's you know don't stick it in your eye but I think this is much better much better this is always gonna stay good and especially because it's probably designed to take it on the road also but mainly because it's uh assemble it and reassemble it um, mainly because it's on the road for the road um, you're gonna you know attach this and detach this all the time I think this is how it should go so there it is 
complete setup. Godox SL60 W and the Light Dome Mini from Aperture. And uh, you know, I bought this on sale. It was from 99 Pro for 79 euros. Uh, and I saw there is the new model, the Mini 2, which goes for 179. So I thought, you know, I'll have this one. Half the price. The other one, there is some advantage to it, but I'm not going to use it. I'm just going to put this thing in the corner and let it sit there. And use it as a uh, key light. You know, just one studio light. Yep, I like it. Let's hook it up. Let's see what it does. We have a power plug ready here. Okay. <coughs> right. Ready? Was it light? Ooh, it's blue. It's white. Ooh. It's a lot of light, isn't it? It's nice and white and clear and ooh, I'm liking it. I'm loving it actually. Here, it's now on uh, thirty-six percent. Let's crank it up. Sixty-three. Can you see the difference? Nah, probably not. Yet. It's a whole lot of light. It's a whole lot of light. Cool. I'm gonna I'm gonna put it on the tripod on the stand and um, and see what happens. Be right back. Okay. So this is the new lighting. Let's switch off the other one. Okay. So now this is. Remote. Ooh, this is dramatic. It's all black on this side. So let's. Okay, a little uh, orange light on the left, um, which is pretty annoying because now I'm looking into a light the whole time. I need glasses now. I now I understand. I get it, Casey. Now I get it. Why Casey Neistat always wears sunglasses? It's the light. It must be. No, he told us, right? He told us. It's because you can, you don't get this. You know, now I'm watching the screen now. And you shouldn't. But you could if you were wearing sunglasses. Maybe you should. Maybe not. Okay. Anyway, this is the uh, this was the unboxing of the Aperture Light Down Mini and the Godox. Uh, SL60W studio lamp light. Um, thanks for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell if you want to get the notifications for my next uh, video. And um, I will see you next time. Go.